We gotta go back to Home Depot because we gotta get the, ooh, it's gonna fall. It's okay. <laughs> the door fell. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a DIY bathroom remodel. Now this bathroom shown right here is the Jack and Jill bathroom, which is upstairs, which is the one that our boys use. And you guys, it was due for a facelift, it really was. So we're gonna jump right into the video. It's gonna be all over the place, but I'll try to make sure to list everything we use in the description, okay? Anyway, y'all, as you can see, he did the floor in here. You guys have seen him put floor in it before. If you watch my channel, it's actually the same way he did our laundry room floor. Um, the floor is from Floor and Decor. Uh, and yeah, watch that video, you'll see. He basically just, it's like a snap floor. What's it called? What's the floor called, Ray? God, don't give me the line. But it's basically the same way he did the laundry room floor. So that's why I didn't really show that part because you, if you guys have been following me, you've seen him put floor before. Um, but yeah, he had it. He did it going all the way into the toilet area. And then out here is actually where the vanity is going to go. So we're going to have one vanity there. And then the other vanity will be right there. Okay, so looking good so far. He already installed the lights, as you can see. The lights were from Home Depot. And the color of the hardware hardware of the lights is actually the same color of the hardware that's um, around the mirror that we chose and it go it coincides with the vanity so everything we kind of match together so i'm excited to see how it's going to look when we actually get the vanities up here and the mirror that's when i feel like it's all coming together but so far so good so i just want to show y'all what was done so far what size door would you say this is this is a 28 inch by 80 inch. Mm -hmm. So this is like your standard door. Standard size door. It's right here. And then you got like for the smaller, like the closet doors, but like closets and storage, it's normally, it's normally the, uh, the 24 by 80. But the thing about these, they can come out. So if you say if you get like a 24, mm -hmm. uh, they'll stretch out to like 28, but it's just, it's just a width. So the width is different. You got 32, you got 36, you got 40, 40, all the way to 48. Yeah. And 40 is like your double doors and stuff. So. Okay. So, so y'all, we have to go back to Home Depot. Oh, I hope y'all can see me. We got to go back. We got to go back to Home Depot because we got to get the... Ooh, it's going to fall. It's okay. <laughs> the door fell, y'all. We got to get the door latches because they didn't have that. It didn't come with it, right? No, no. Was it supposed to come with it? No, they don't. Okay, so we got to go back and get the latches mm -hmm. for the door so he can actually put it up because there will be a total of one, two, three doors that's going upstairs in the bathroom. You got one for the toilet area, one for the entryway, and then one that connects the room from our kids' room to the bathroom. So, yeah. Back to Home Depot. Not we even. Go. It's not even. So, we got to take this back down, cut, a, cut this out. Mm -hmm. And move this over about four inches right there. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, because it got to be even with the Yeah, they're not going to be saying, nah, let's do it right. So we got to move this over and then we got to fix everything back up. Yeah, no, no, that's right. Do it. You're going to do it right. That's right. You just said no, huh? <laughs> you going to come and help? You don't need my help. You got pop now. Look, oh, uh, pop now. <laughs> this shit happened when I won't that. So what? <laughs> what you, I didn't help with the paint. Are <laughs> you going to tell them about this floor? Uh. Yeah, Pop, you want to tell them about the floor box? You no, know you know the name here. of it, right? What was the name of this floor? Um, this is the same floor no, the from... the floor is right here. So, mm -hmm. uh, this is... Mm -hmm. I can't think of the name of it, but it's right here. This is the name, this is the floor. And we got like, it's kind of like... A, a the floor is like the same snap, it's the same concept as the floor in our laundry room. If y'all seen our laundry room video, yeah. it's the same concept, but you know, it's like a snap. 
And this one is called it's, it's hydro. Water it's water resistant. Hydro Shield is good. Okay, so it's good for hydro. bathrooms and laundry rooms. Okay, and it's water resistant. Yeah. Okay, and this is the floor that we got. And Ray put it in all by himself. Yeah. He's a professional now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Everything, everything, yeah. Everything's even, but yeah. just gotta, had all. Uh, we had to get the fold up on stuff, but we oh, got okay. it straight. Okay. Yeah, Pop got some finishing touches he's going to put in here, so. Okay. Yeah. So this is how the upstairs bathroom is looking so far. This is the one that our boys oh, use. <laughs> and those lights we got from Home Depot. We got a set of two, one there and one there. This is a Jack and Jill bathroom. So we have a zinc here and the other zinc will go right here, y'all. So that's just to give y'all a quick update. All right, so that's just to give y'all a quick update. Oh Lord, I'm dropping stuff. All right, so that's just to give y'all a quick update of our upstairs bathroom. Cause I don't think um, I showed y'all the beginning of it yet, but that's just what we're doing. Hopefully by this week it'll be complete and I can actually show y'all. Well, it'll be done today? Two days. Two, two days. days. <laughs> so when it's done, of course, I will be doing, uh, um, you know, uh, before and after. And maybe in the next video, the next home update, I'll show you the before and after of the upstairs bathroom. Okay, because you guys seen my master bathroom, but you haven't seen that one yet. That's the one that my kids use. All right. guys so this is the new and improved bathroom i think everything looks good everything turned out pretty decent this is one side and then this is the other side Let me see if I can zoom out. Let me zoom out some more. This is far as it will let me go. I am loving the vanity, y'all. I'm loving the vanities and how they look. I really do think it comes together really nice. In our son's bathroom, we want to keep everything just as minimum and basic as possible. You know, so that it looks clean. The less is more. This is how this one looks. Same mirrors on both sides. Everything looks pretty good. I'm very happy with the results. The floors are nice. 
The paint color looks good. Everything kind of matches together very well. That door is to my son's bedroom. That door leads to the hallway. And then here is the toilet area. So this is how it looks when you walk in. That rug, most of the rugs that we got are from Ross. Um, I just cleaned up in here. So that's Fabuloso in the toilet. That's why it looks pink. <laughs> apple kind and then we also got a new toilet this is the flush toilet with the two um buttons we kept the shower area pretty basic um the rod is a curved rod that came from home depot as well and then if you look up that light fixture right there came from home depot so we kept everything pretty basic in here everything is pretty basic and I like the way it looks because I think, again, less is more and it looks pretty clean and neat. And then, you know, the less we have to worry about in the boys' room, the better. Because if you have boys, you already know how it is clean up after them and trying to make sure everything stays that way. <laughs> okay, so this is it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this DIY bathroom remodel. Until next time, bye you too.